Good afternoon from a very busy Saturday at SeaWorld. We're finally here at the Seven Seas Food Festival. Let's do it. Here's a list of all the events coming up this year. Craft Beer Festival, heck yes. All right, we're in. First stop, sample lanyard. Lots of booze options. First stop is the Florida stand. We're gonna get shrimp mac and cheese. Okay, so the first thing we got is shrimp mac and cheese and key lime, what was this? Martini. Martini, no, and fritter things, I don't know. This would have been $6.49, this would have been $4.99. This macaroni, shrimp macaroni, is absolutely amazing. These deep fried key lime pie pieces, absolutely amazing. Okay, next up we got chicken on a stick, I can't remember what the name was. I don't know. We have to go quick because of all the music playing loudly in the background. Don't want a copyright claim. It's Saturday. Where are all the people at? The parking lot's full. There's no one over here in the food area. It's crazy. Okay, all was going well until we got the Brazilian steak. This is nowhere near as much as the picture shows or their little sample they had on display. What the heck? The steak is by far the best so far, but that little bit would have been seven dollars without the lanyard. Kind of steep, but it is a food festival. Here's a list of all the concerts and acts coming tonight. Lifehouse will be here. Here's Bayside Stadium, where they do the concerts at. He said Lifehouse is tonight. I don't know if we're gonna be here or not, but if we are, we'll watch them. Stopped off to swap our fuel rods. Success. Update. I found all the people. Okay, next up, at the crawfish boil, which looks amazing. The shrimp po' boy, which looks way better than the one down the road at the other place. Crawfish boil was really not that great. The shrimp po' boy was amazing. So, uh, found more people. We've used a punch and got a beer. Infinity Falls is back open after it's not so annual refurbishment. It's got an hour wait. Well, we jinxed it. Infinity Falls is back open, but now this raft is stuck at the top of the, of the waterfall here. Before there were humans, there was Geraldine. See all the fish? I'm gonna go with Fluffy. It's the statue water fountain lady, like they have at Bush Gardens Food and Wine Fest. Come on, be like Halloween and jump out and scare people. I didn't realize that charging admission to this thing was still a thing. Luckily, pass holders are free. You spend $100 to get in the park and you gotta pay extra to ride the Sky Tower. I don't think that that's okay. It's just me.
journey to Atlantis is back open, but there's nobody on it. Well dang, I was trying to get to the top of the world and went the wrong way. Smells like fish. And I found more people. Alright, so remember earlier we said that we didn't know if we were going to come watch the concert? Well, I got dragged to it. So we're going to watch Little Lifehouse. Uh, I'm not even going to sugarcoat this. The crowd for them is pretty, pretty light. For a Saturday. how they play the concert throughout the speakers in the park. So wherever you're at in the park, you can hear the concert. You don't have to be in the stadium. Everybody's leaving. And thus concludes our first time at SeaWorld's Seven Seas Food Festival. Lifehouse is still playing. I had to stop the video for a second. I don't want a damn copyright claim for the millionth time. I'll probably still get one anyway. Anyways, food was good. Kind of pricey, but if you get the lanyard, it's not too bad. And Lifehouse is meh. Sorry. What is Lifehouse's biggest hit? This is that holding on, barely breathing song. I don't know. I would sing it to you, but again, I get a copyright claim. I have a voice of the angels. So. Oh, this. Oh. Geraldine says you and me. Oh yeah, that would be the. Yeah, probably. I don't know. So, <laughs> all right. Till next time. See you guys.